Aloha on this NFL Sunday. Broncos playing tomorrow. Welcome back to Bruce with Beck. I'm your host, Dan. How the hell are you? I'm, um, I'm decent. I'm decent. Might be stellar soon after I drink this beer. Anyway, thank you for, thank you for asking. Appreciate that. Um, the one we're looking at right now is a familiar brewery that I love out of California. Humble Sea Brewing out of Santa Cruz, California. This one is, uh, literally was literally brewed on me and my wife's anniversary. So, Big Ups DL, October 4th, that's when it was brewed. So it's literally 12 days in the can. So very fresh and with a good date to be brewed on. Anyway, 10.4 on the Richter. Triple. All right. Uh, I got this from Handy Market when I came home from a good bus victory yesterday. Uh, glad they still had it. Um, anyway, yeah. Foggy triple I IPA with Citra, Galaxy, Sabro, and Eldorado hops. It is double dry hopped. It's, I think it said hop fuse too. Um, says on the description here, it's supposed to maybe get an aroma of diesel, lemon peel, and lime zest with a flavor of tangerine, limeade, and Sprite. I, you know, I had to go back and revisit Eldorado hops. It's supposed to somewhat give you pineapple, pear, and, uh, you know, I think stone fruit. So, anyway, I'm just looking for an awesome beer because a lot of people seem to think this is pretty awesome at 434 4 out of a 5 on on tap. So, yeah, even Peyton. Peyton would love this beer. My buffs would love this beer. And uh, who else would love this beer? Yeah. Okay. You gonna love this beer? Boom. All right. Let's get to it, shall we? On NFL Sunday, let's roll with Humble C Triple New England IPA. All righty. If you haven't already uh, pressed that like button, please, please, if I could say please, Please press that like button, and if you haven't already subscribed, help me out, and please subscribe. We'd we'll love to see you every four times a week, or more, so you can sit down with a cold beverage with me anytime you want. All right, all right, all right. Please like and subscribe. Thank you. You guys are awesome. Um, all right. Looking like uh, pineapple juice. Used to it. But... You know, it's a 10.4 looking pineapple juice. Let's get an aroma on Sunday. Ooh, even get kind of like a little juicy pineapple and some dry hop. Maybe. I don't get diesel, buddy. At least not off the bat. Yeah, I do. I mean, I get like lemon and pineapple and, and dry hop. So, all right. Well, one of these days I'll make it to Humble Sea Brewing. So anyway, no words, just emotions. NFL Sunday. Cheers to you. And if you need to pause, go get yourself a, a drink. I'll wait. Okay. We're back. Okay. Let's get this. Non-Broncos, but NFL Sunday. Let's go. Ooh. All right. Got like a little bit of a caramel sweetness. Going with the, uh, you know, it's always weird that I say caramel sweetness when I'm drinking a triple IPA, but caramel sweetness that fades into some hot pepper. Maybe get some uh, just ever so slight, mm, like, gosh, that's all. It's funny that they say flavor limeade and Sprite. You do get a little bit of carbonation and, you know, some citrus, but I almost feel like, um, Maybe a little grapefruit pill, not much, but very delicious. It's again, it's sweet and pepper, peppery with this one. Um, wow! All right. That's that's kind of crazy. Um, with Sabro, you're supposed to maybe get a little bit of a hint of like some kind of coconut flavor. Maybe, maybe that's kind of what, like, the edge of sweetness is, but, um, again, it's not super sweet or anything, it's just, you know, it's not just straight, straight hot pepper, so. Alrighty, so far, digging it, um, not gonna lie, I think it does come off like a triple, like, it's that aggressive with the flavor, and you can kind of feel the last bit of, uh, edge on it to where, I would probably guess this was you know, 10 or 10.2, so would have been a little off is 10.4, but uh, mouthfeel. It's pretty good. 
pretty big. I mean, you know, Steve Carell joke. Um, it's, uh, I'd say, I don't know, 50, 50 out of 100, maybe 55. But a lot of people think it's very big mouthfeel, but I'd say medium. Anyway, um, hopefully your cold beverage is going down well. I'm going to hit pause and try to analyze more of what I think of this, give it a grade, and go watch some more football. So uh, hopefully your fantasy team is doing well. Yeah, trophy's back there. You got one? Maybe. Uh, give me a second. Barkey, uh, go back and go in old school. I want just literally a shot of just ice cold vodka after the, after this bad boy. You know, just just feeling it. And by the way, watching the game today, what the hell happened to Aaron Rodgers this year? Uh, did he literally fall off a cliff after two MVPs? Don't know. Anyway, so we'll see. Maybe he'll come back to prove me wrong. But um, let's get back to the beer. Looked on. Uh, Humble C's site. This one is out of stock. So glad Mark was able to get it for me at Handy Market. Cheers to you. Um, yeah, good good price on this one. Se seven bucks a can. Uh, I think they probably went for like twenty five or twenty six at the the brewery. So appreciate that, brother. Um, all right. So nothing much changed. Like good good pillowy citrus and like kind of s subtle caramel sweetness to go with like a little bit of like green hot pepper, if you will. Um, You know, I can see why they'd say maybe a little, a little diesel, but not as much diesel fuel as, as some. But um, yeah, this one's uh, coming off real nice. Uh, very happy I was able to grab it. And uh, yeah, let's get to the rating so I can watch some more football. From Stellar down to Hell No. On your football day. Let's see. I'm going to make this a, yeah, I mean, very, very good. Just like not exactly A plus, but like absolute, absolute solid A, 96 out of 100. Wanted to grade at 97 and all that. Um, some people might. Personally, the, I don't know, with these, I almost, I don't, the, when I get that little caramel kind of like malt mm -hmm. note to go along with the pepper. It's interesting. I don't know if I love it, and that's just my personal preference. So, um, there you go. Yeah, no, that's the best way I can say it. There's a little bit of like a caramel sweetness going on with this. Usually I should like, and I don't hate it, but it, it is it, it does make it a little interesting, but definitely a, a solid, solid 96 out of 100. Absolutely worth $6.99 a can. Would definitely recommend it. Uh, it's already out of stock in Humble Sea, as I said, so. But I think they, they uh, do rotate this one in and out, so uh, that's about it. Uh, just like me, I need to go to Santa Cruz. You goes, you guys need to check out Santa Cruz and Humble Sea. What up, Humble Sea, if you're seeing me? Uh, remember to like and subscribe. Really appreciate you. Let's go, Broncos. Let's get to that NFL Sunday. Like and subscribe. Appreciate y'all. See you out there.